All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Tuesday. We are playing uh, the Silent Swordsman, Phantom Knight, whatever deck, and uh, we are joined by Alexis. Hey, everybody. So uh, it's actually our second recording. First recording was Cancer, and uh, I was like, no, you guys yeah, need to see we... that. You don't yeah, see we it. made a little bit of a misplay, and we got destroyed by Crystal Meth, so... Yeah, the guy was like, oh... Oh, God. Cubics. Cubics. Yeah. The guy was I'm like, oh, I didn't open up well, and he, with DDDs, he's like, I didn't open up well, and then proceeded to bust out a Hope, a Siegfried, and a Crystal Myth first turn. <laughs> I would like to know how that was a brick. I would I would honestly love to know how that was a brick. <laughs> like, uh, somebody please. Wow. So, Cubics. I guess he's he wants to bust out that fusion monster. The fusion conscription grab that guy and then maybe bust out if he busts out that fucking fusion monster, that's gonna be a real struggle. <laughs> Definitely. Well I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for a um I'm gonna go for a rank seven Xyz summon turn one. What what? Flare? Yeah. Burn and summon. Flare summon out summon out another red eyes and do all that shenanigans. What was the second one I'm supposed to send? Oh right, you send the uh, you send the you send the keeper. Oh yeah, yeah, get your keeper in the grave. Uh, so next we go for one, go for one for one, ditching this turbine, just summon out the stone. Then the stone triggers. I mean, you tribute it to special summon a red eyes, and then you use the turbine to special summon another red eyes. Yep. Uh, we're still playing. Someone... We're still playing the Phantom Knight because I feel like it's a strong deck. Uh, it's a warrior base, so it works well with Silent Swordsman, and uh, we can do the Dark Requiem plays, because that's now on here, so... That, I mean, you get a two-for-one. Yeah, for one. With, a slight, with a slightly bugged effect. Yeah, yeah. We actually... That well, was one of the reasons, another one of the reasons why we lost. I decided not even to keep it in. It was like 20 minutes of just stupidity. Like, it was cancer. It was cancer. <laughs> I opened up shit. Let me bust out a fucking Crystal Mess sick for you to hope. I opened up like shit. Like, all right. All right. <laughs> yeah, that was probably the most overpowered brick ever, apparently. Like, even dragon rulers, when they brick, can't do that. God's like, oh, well, usually I'm able to bust out Omega and a, and a fucking uh, a Stardust with this. It's like, god damn. Like, DDD, you need to calm the fuck down. <laughs> also, I still have my normal summon. I mean, if you want a normal summon anything, what do you have in your hand? I have double Kinkaboo, so I might as well use one of them to deal more damage. But then won't your stone get negated? Unless you're gonna make a XE. I'm gonna make I'm gonna make the fusion monster. Oh, oh right, right, right. I forgot about that play. Yep. Uh, uh Odd Eyes Beast Dragon? Or Beast Eyes Dragon? Yeah, something. Beast Eyes Pendulum Dragon, that's I think. It, that's it, yeah. Beast Eyes I was like Odd Eyes Beast Dragon. No, Beast Eyes Pendulum Dragon. Close enough, close enough. Damn, that's a lot of damage. Damn, yep. if this was a single, so... that'd be game. <laughs> yeah, hopefully he doesn't have, like, gores in his hand. Like, every time I try... What am I kidding? This is Cubics. He's not going to have a gores. <laughs> gores. <laughs> I said, I think that guy is maybe just trying to bust out his, uh, his fusion monster. I've seen Cubics do a lot more than just that. I don't really see them playing Fusion Construction unless they're playing, playing going for the Fusion Monster. That's but they don't even need to do that. Like, just that monster alone is, is good as a standalone monster. Yeah, I think that the Fusion Turbo deck is probably the strongest version, but I don't really like it because it's very, very easily stopped by, like, anything. Okay. If they return it okay, right so now, it's not bad. Yeah, I opened up pretty decently. Mm -hmm. That's if you opened up with some background to defend yourself, but by that, oh. of course. Okay, well, I'm going to lose my, my monsters, but I get to keep my red eyes flare metal. I mean, you got anything to say about that in the number generator that you just got hit with? Fucking 50-something <laughs> card deck still opens up with a geki? Uh, it's whatever. I get to use my keeper to shrine and special summon it and add a red eyes to my hand, so not horrible. Mm-hmm. It'd be better, but it's not horrible. Yeah, do it's ever geeky. Quickness. I mean, didn't even cons you know, consider it. He's just like, bam, we're geeky. Like, all right. So, uh, now continue That's... with your plays. I don't think he has any more plays. Wow. Well, he does. He just misclicked. 
Do you have anything to say about that? That in I say 50... that he's opening up. Hmm? Open up opening with what? up all the. Oh, what? All open the up all the cards. Of what else? <laughs> Fucking number generator, though. So great. You get to draw a card. I can't do any damage. That's fair. Okay, so what are we. Oh, God. Are we fighting a Wind Creep, a level 10 deck that's, for some unknown reason, 50 cards? Yep. I mean, you could play that pot of cupidity, so. Yeah, yeah that might be why he's running it. I still don't agree with that logic, but then again, the OCG and TCG have very different mindsets when it comes to what the. I have to actually, actually, I have to, I have okay. to actually read this card. I don't know what it does. I don't like it. Oh, okay. It's it's uh, not very good. No. You're not plussing. You're not doing anything. Like really. Okay. Well, I guess go ahead and kill him, you bell. I wish. I, have, I wish I have I, full uh, faith in your ability to kill him. Honestly, you have a keeper to shrine if that's going to be of any value to you. Mm. Honestly, you can use my red eyes flare metal if you need to get more of, um, big monsters on the field for some reason. Although with Wing Karibo on the field, I don't think it's going to be relevant. I don't think so. I think, I think that's really all I want to do as of right now. I say just go ahead and kill the Wing Kariba and whatever the scent monster is and just that's call it a turn if you have nothing else. I got some back row at least. I think for now. I had Twin Twister. I'm not sure if I want to hold it in my hand or set it. Well, I have a Twin Twister in my hand, so okay. if necessary, I'll just use it in my turn. Okay, so I'll just hold on to it. Like, I can't imagine that they're going to play some kind of continuous spell that we have to immediately negate, you know? So this guy didn't really do much. That's well, fine. I guess he got some life points back, but my red eyes flare metal is just going to... Okay, why didn't it trigger? Oh, right, that's a continuous effect. Mm -hmm. so, my bad. I'm good. I can't do any damage, so I'll clear up resources. What's this, what is this guy playing? I don't even remember what this guy is playing. Um, well, he's playing Cubics, remember? Oh, right, 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 right. No, I didn't. <laughs> Cubics, that's right. But do you think this deck is better than the uh, digital bugs that we got raped with? Yeah, I mean, at least you're doing something. <laughs> you didn't really do much of anything in that duel. <laughs> I did something, but it wasn't anything you wanted. Oh, God, he summoned out the... Please tell me you're going to Solemn Strike that. Yeah. That card is fucking power. No, thank you. Watch you have another one. Okay, I'm gonna kill him now. Uh, I'm gonna... no, there's nothing to do. Okay, I'm just gonna kill him now. Okay, I have no idea what. Oh right, you you just get gain another levels. Five. Yep, getting another five hundred. Okay, well first things first. Let's go ahead and twin twister away whatever it is you have back there. Get rid of that and get rid of the field spell just in case. Mm -hmm. hey, what, let me was, what did he have? Ah, uh, it was the unification. I thought, let me guess, it's unification. unification. So you can banish this card for your guard, push summon a level 4 lower cubic monster in normal summon condition, and it cannot be sure about it by card effects this turn. So, yep. And he can summon the, the one, level 1 that can't be sure of battle. <laughs> yep, and I'm gonna just. I'm just gonna start spamming the monsters now. I mean, you can't kill him this turn, so... I can. How? I have a lot of damage on the field. But you know that he could just summon a monster that can't be destroyed battle, right? Wait, how? Unification, the trap card that you just popped with, with Twin Twisters. I was thinking that think when you... you might... You might have... You might want to reread it. That only works if I destroy a cubic by battle or a card effect. No, the second effect. Yeah, that only works if I... You could banish this card from a graveyard, special summon a level 4 or lower cubic monster from your hand or deck, ignoring summon conditions. If you do, it cannot be destroyed battle by card effect this turn. Okay, then maybe I gotta reread it, because I'm, re I'm reading that it only works, that that effect only triggers when a monster is destroyed. Yeah, you know, I gotta quickly finish oh, this game up, and then... Oh, face up Pokemon monster to destroy battle, blah, blah, blah. I could've sworn he just, just banished it. I skipped over that part. I didn't see the semicolon, that's okay. what was a period. 
Yeah, oh, you might, so you I might actually read it right. It. Yeah, you read it right. I read it wrong because I didn't read. The, I didn't see the semicolon. I thought there was a period and went from there to the rest. All right, so I think you might have this then. And yeah, I should have game unless he has some kind of miracle in his hand. I don't believe they play anything to block attacks. I mean, I really didn't do much. <laughs> Just some of the silent swordsmen that set a solemn strike, so I didn't do shit. You did everything on this duel. Well, the Psalm Strike did stop their strongest monster. True. Yeah, no doubt that monster would have been a little bit of trouble for us both if it was left to run free. You probably could have handled it. If you would have went, in, went against Flare, you could have just played. I could have just played Wings when he attacked, and if he would have went after Silent Swordsman, I would still got Silent Swordsman level seven, so. So I think it would have been okay. We still would have got our life points. Is it like life point? Don't we like lose three thousand during the interface or something like that? Both of us. And an error occurred just as I was about to attack for game. They quit. Oh, no, okay. no, wait, no. I think it said we lose. What wow, I, mean? I I was about I, to kill them. I think because of the error. I don't know. Whatever. We won. All right, get another duel. Bear back. Okay. Well, can you give me quick? Can you give me about a minute to go see what I'm, what they want me for? Mm-hmm. Then they're gonna make you go first, or are they going first? They're going first. Okay, Doki. Well, let's see what I draw into this time. Ten's not bad. I might take him out. The only reason I ran him is because I thought maybe he would have more synergy with the deck, but he really doesn't. Who doesn't have synergy? I'm running Captain. If he's not even necessary. Well, I mean, he's he's okay for the purpose of getting out another, you know, getting out. Getting out of bricks, but I mean, Rhoda does that anyway when you can add that one Phantom Knight to special summon itself. Ouch. Also, we're fighting Shadals. I need to draw into my Blackstone of Legend immediately so I can run over this. Mm hmm. That's why you can fuck up Falcon and then reset again during his partner's turn. Yeah, you need Blackstone immediately. Okay, this hand's not good. So him. I mean, it you, would be him. Me. You know what the real suck thing is? Is that what? I? Is that he? He goes after me. So I'm. I do exceed plays. He could just push it all fusion. Like that sucks. The good news is though that I actually do have a silver's cry, so I can actually. Oh, that works. Make a play. I can actually make a play. I'm debating if I want to send uh, Black Flare, Metal Dragon, and Gemini Summon it to deal burn damage. Or just send a Keeper. Keeper. I'm going to send a Keeper so that we can actually defend ourselves. I don't care about the burn. <laughs> <sighs> That's the suck thing, is that even if we kill the window, the window was, he could just flip up the Falco and the Falco can grab the window. But at least the window will be set for the turn. So that on my turn I can actually do something. I, I have a great hand. I can do plays. It's just... I don't like the idea of the fucking shit all guys just being like, oh, shit all fusion, because you have an extra deck monster, because I'll probably have an extra deck monster, depending on what plays I do to respond to his plays. You got like a twin twister or anything to pop back row? I don't. I actually bricked most of my red eyes. It would have been an okay hand, but the uh, Winda kind of made me have to do an awkward play to get rid of it. Mm. Any set cards? Like if he had any other monster, I would have. No. Nothing. Okay. I actually drew two of my normal red eyes monsters from my deck to my hand, so I can't even use the monster I just set. Mm. Well, actually, I can, but it will be a minus. We're lucky. Maybe they won't do anything to us. And also, you feel free to use the Carbidon to, uh, you know, to make an exceed summon. Yeah. Because it happens to be a level three, so it is. Something you can use. Mm -hmm. Seven DX. I'm kind of debating on what he want. He's gonna do and what he's gonna play. Because it could be cancerous. Well, we don't know what he's playing yet, but it, apparently it's something slow because he just sets and I think he's gonna end. Okay. It'd be nice to run over the 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 Falco. Without, I guess I could still attack into it if we have no, because you could possibly do some kind of extra deck esque play. Well, if you can kill the Falco with a card effect and then attack. Hello? 
Hello? Lexus? Hold on. Okay, that was weird. Skype just decided to crap out on us. Uh, it's not I'm... like I just... Sorry, what? I have play, but I don't want to access the extra deck, you know? Yeah, that's sort of a problem. Michael. Like I said, you could always just run over the Falco and then run over the Winda. It's not like Winda has a really high defensive stat. It's only 800. Oh, true, true. I forgot that Winda only has that small little booty. I was thinking about going to like a Break Sword, but I guess I could do that main phase too. And crack the other card. And then just leave Break Sword in the, in the graveyard. Because I still got, I got a Gloves and I got a Boots, but I'm not going to do that play this turn. Yeah, and just hit the sword. Well, just make your play, because you're about to time out. Took a lot of time to. One thing I hate. About... You hate about what? I would say. No, I was just saying it took. One a... thing I don't like. Go ahead. I guess say one thing I don't like about Death Pro is the time limit. Mm-hmm. Like I don't think you might you're even gonna have enough time to see some, and you're just gonna have to end a turn killing Winda. Yep, I'm about to end my turn like immediately right now. I'm not even be able to set any cards. Out whatever... Oh, it's Gradles. Ew. Whoa. I'm a little bit terrified now. Yep, yep. Immediately end my turn before I could even do anything. Hmm. Well, I guess it's okay. I mean, we got rid of the window, so it's all good. You know, unless he shut off fusions into another window. Although, if he does that, I can just run it over with red eyes. Mm-hmm. I don't have anything that's extra deck, so if you want to shut off fusion, I mean, you gotta fuse with the resources in your hand. Oh, he's playing this variant. Mm. Well, I have Twin Twister, so I could just pop that. Like I said it would have been nice. Sounds good. It would have been nice if I was able to set, like, myself and strike, but. It just fuck me, I guess. Got time limit, though. The time we took to. Get Skype reorganized when we're disconnected from each other. Wasted a lot of my time on my bar. Yeah. Well, I guess it's okay as long as we don't get completely blown out this turn, but I have a strong suspicion that we are going to. Probably. You gotta get another Insta Fusion for Norton, so. And that's one, two, okay, three, I four, five, he's... six, seven, eight, nine. That's Trish right there with the Gradle. Yeah, he could Trish us right now. I, I hope that he doesn't hit. Oh, am I kidding? He's going to hit my. Oh, yeah. Actually, he can't. No way he yeah, does. He's going to Trish. He's going to hit your Norton keeper. Was... He's going to hit your probably your red eyes. Yep, yep, yep. See, see, Norton's fair. Norton's fair. <laughs> According to Konami, Norton is perfectly fair as a one of. Oh, he's going to hit my Kerbine. I mean, he could run over the red. Probably going to so. hit my. Probably going to hit my. My uh, keeper. Yeah, there's nothing next. else in there. I was gonna hit, hit Rhoda. Oh, of course, and he fucking hit my goddamn gloves. Wow, I needed that. Ah! This is not fair. <laughs> yep, because Norton is totally fair. Okay, I gotta, I gotta figure out a way out of this. Hey, uh, is that one new spell card TCG legal yet? What? The one that special summons a dragon from the graveyard? No. When is it going to be TCG legal uh, again? The Felgrim Structure Deck. Yeah, I mean, what date is that coming out in? I'm not 100% sure. I don't know off the top of my mind. Uh, that's annoying. And a butt ton of background, still... too. Well, at least we know one of them is fucking shit. Like, wow. Just fucking. It's a, it's a fucking. Just no, no. He should be banned. Like, I don't know why fucking. TCG kept him. Like, why the fuck would you keep him? Totally unfair. Totally unfair. Yeah, I read what I just said. Mm-hmm. Also, I can't even do anything, because all my monsters are the level 7 Red Eyes monsters. Yep, nope, we can't do shit. I ha if I had a, a cards from the red, I, at the very least, I could trade these in to try to get some stuff I need. That's annoying. You know what would have been nice? If I would have set that Solemn Strike, I wouldn't even care because I could have just Solemn Strike Trish. But fucking it timed me out, so then I had to deal with Trish, get my shit banished, and now, unless I literally draw into a Phantom Knight, I'm probably fucked. Not including the back row. And I gotta guess what the back row is because, you know. 
there's bottomless back there, and I really don't want, I would rather not get bottomless, but then there's also just fucking bluffs, so. Just fuck me. Just fuck me. Yeah, that time, that time limit really screwed us over real hard. Mm hmm because I would have had strike face down, so I would have, as soon as you wanted to strike, so. Yep. Not even including the fucking yeah, Gradle so... Players guy cards. So, fuck me. I don't even me. think it's a Gradle deck, I think. So, I literally had to draw into a Phantom Knight monster. Then... And then you gotta hope that you don't get bottomless. Yep, yeah, and then hope that I hit the bottomless. It's a Twin Twister. Didn't she say she had Twin no, Twister? Or was, was that like... last duel? That was last duel, wasn't it? That was last duel. Well, what was the last duel? Uh, you had Twin Twisters. Yeah, I had Twin Twister last duel. Right now I have three red eyes and a Kinkaboo that can't do anything. Yep, sounds great. More background? No, right. Well, it doesn't appear to be Gradle. If nope. it was, nope. did you draw it? Nope. <laughs> nope. So GG, we lose. Ah, uh, I wouldn't say we lose, but I I got two strikes, so that's great. I can go twin twister. That would have been. I can go twin twister, pitch the boots, and then I can banish the boots and get me a fog blade. I have or my sword, and then my sword can banish to summon boots back, but. I thought I drew into a Phantom Knight. My plays would have been a lot better. I guess I should just Twin Twister and pop two of the set cards. Good job. That might be the best play we have, because I don't think we have any legitimate answers to his current field. Let's see if I get the bottomless. If we're lucky, we're... Oh, All right. God. All right, we're done. We're done. We're done. All right, we'll get a different duel. We are back. No, we're just going to get annoyed the hell out of, because that was the Gradle guy, and yay, Gradles. And then this guy's probably playing Monarchs, I'm assuming. I mean, they opened up decently this time. Are you going first? Are you going first? Yes. I mean, is there really any reason to go off too much going first with the Red Eyes? Isn't that more of an aggressive deck that will let well, you gonna... a second? I'm gonna... Well, I'm going to summon the uh, the Red Eyes Flare Metal, because I don't lose too much summoning it. Okay. Where's your red eyes fusion? Where's that? I don't run it. What? It's like the most broken card. Over... It's like the most broken card in red over... eyes. That would also require me to run a uh, a summon skull. Also, I just realized I don't have the stone. I thought I did. Okay, so I guess you're done. Anyway, that would require me to, su to run summon skull, and I'm not gonna run a card that encourages bricking just for one monster. Okay. That's just my thought on it. It's like if I open up the summon skull and I don't have the the um what am I thinking of? And I don't have the fusion or you know, if I open up the summon skull and don't have the fusion, then I just lose and that's just not something I wanna do. Also I have twin twister, so I'm thinking I'm gonna twin twister him in the end phase. Got so much back row, damn. And that's a gradle. Okay. Cause it's the same Probably fucking a gradle, guy. but I'm going to twin twister him in the in the end phase. Yay, Gradles. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and pitch my normal red eyes because I can get it back easily. And then let's blow up that and we'll blow up that and see what on earth I hit. Probably impact. Parasite. And I hit a Starlight Road. I hit Starlight Road and Gradle Parasite. That's good. That means that you don't have to be terrified if you have something that destroys multiple cards now. Okay. Do you have any plays? Uh, okay, good, you have yeah. plays. I opened up pretty well. Okay, so I have my field set up. All I have to do is draw a, a stone or basically any uh, any way to... I have like... I have nine cards that I can draw to make my one card in hand turn into explosive plays. <laughs> Summon, go into a break sword, crack that back row. If I go in, yep. if I go into Brick Sword and I Brick Sword and I pop him, where would the chain go? Wouldn't he take one of my Phantom Knight monsters that I summoned back with Brick Sword or no? No, because you have no monsters on the field at the time the Grado would try to trigger. Okay, so I think I'll just go ahead and do that then. Yippee, someone actually trusts me with rulings. I, I offer the help all the time on DN and people just laugh at me. Go ahead and 
crack yourself, and then I guess crack the great along. I'm wondering about the set, but I'm not sure if it's too much of a threat, you know? Wow, did we just get dis disconnected from Skype again? Like, what the fuck, Skype? Welcome back. What the fuck? Okay, that time it was definitely not on me, was it? I don't know. I don't know. Mm. But anyway, as I told you, the Gradle will not trigger on you, so yep. enjoy those two free monsters. I'm just kind of wondering what I should go into. There's really nothing to do too much, you know? Well, do you have Evil Swarm Nightmare? If you want to play defensively? Nope. Probably should have put him in there. Yeah, Daniel. Uh, Dark Rebellion, Kara Gorgon. Kara Gorgon probably wouldn't be terrible. I don't know what the other guy's playing. Well, you, can, you could also play, uh, you can also play, uh, Key Beetle and just use my Field Spell as protection if you want. Yeah. It's up to you, I don't mind. I already got my Keeper in the Graveyards, and I already have my combo play if I draw into, you know, quite a few cards, so. Mm-hmm. Feel free to use my field spell to keep yourself safe from Regeki or whatever. You know, unless he actually is playing Monarchs, in which case we are in trouble. That would be disgusting. Like, I, I'm not even sure if I would even fucking continue this video if it's fucking Monarchs. Well, if it's Monarchs, don't you have a Phantom Knight trap card in your graveyard? No, you don't. I thought you did. Mm -hmm. I was going to say, say, if you did, I could just use that, tribute summon a Red Eyes, and then use the Kerbon in my graveyard. You perform an exceed summon because I have a tribute summon monster on the field. Please don't be monarchs. For the love of Christ, don't be monarchs. I'll cry. I will cry. I, I will cry. Please don't be monarchs. Like Gradles and monarchs. I'm done. It's monarchs. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm tired of this video. I'm tired of fucking cancer. Fucking Gradles and fun. Wow, Gradles, Gradles, Gradles and uh, and monarchs. Mmm. Mmm. Cancer. <laughs> I can handle. The I can handle the Gradles, but I can't handle the Monarchs and the Gradles at the same time, oh, and oh, they just... just quit. What? The Gradles and Monarchs? Like, wow, just fuck us. Like, just, just fuck us. Fucking Cancer of Yu-Gi-Oh, let's go. Whatever, we're done. We're done. I probably wanted to do this play, but I guess I couldn't do it anymore after I summoned that. Because I guess I can only... Can I? Hmm. It's gotta be... I just bought it the day before we left. Anyway, we're done. Oh, I, I kind of wish that Alexis would have muted her mic, because I'm in the video anyway, but, uh... I'll be right back, you bell. I'm ending the video. All right, all right, we're done anyway. So, uh, anyway, thanks for watching. We're done. Um, yeah, I'll probably take out Ryan Cop Captain. He's not necessary. Like the 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 Phantom Knight plays only really work with Phantom Knights. Like even when I go to go to Break Sword, I would like to revive too. So early game is not that great. I guess late game he's okay, but yeah. Anyway, I apologize for echoey sound. If there's echoey sound in this video, there probably is. Um, yeah, my my. My living room is really big. I don't have a room of my own, and it bounces off the walls, and uh, I don't have any foam, so I'm actually going to get a little foam cover to go around the mic. So uh, I did one day shipping, so it should be here by tomorrow, by Wednesday. So hopefully that'll help. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And uh, yeah, I mean, yu gi -Oh still cancer, but what are you going to do, right? Just Monarchs and Tag. Let's go. All right, fun. So tired of Monarchs. I can't wait for them to get hit. Can't wait. All right, people. Thanks for watching. Oh, and thank you, Alexis, for joining me, even though you're not here. And uh, uh, go ahead and check out Alexis' channel. Thanks for watching.